Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. A particular welcome to Brisbane, to Dr. Kadri. It was a great honour to meet you earlier. And your family as well. Wonderful to have your family here. In a few hours' time, after we all go to bed this evening, something quite remarkable will happen on the other side of the world. Because at about three o'clock in the morning, we'll see the beginning of the opening ceremony of the Olympic Games in Paris. And it's remarkable because it's an event that brings every nation together. People from every background, from different cultures and religions, together in a sense of harmony and friendly competition. And it's remarkable also because in just eight years' time, that will all be happening right here in the city of Brisbane. Our vision is to see Brisbane to be that place of harmony, to be that place where the world unites, to be that place where cultures and religions come together and to be a beacon for other places in the world. The world are becoming more and more divided. But we can change that. We can change that by focusing on the things that unite us, by focusing on commonalities, by focusing on what we are the same in rather than what we are different in. And tonight, we will hear from a very great man, a man who has spent a lifetime bringing people together, promoting harmony and peace and understanding. And that is exactly what this world needs right now. I want to thank Dr. Kadri for his leadership, for doing us the great honour of visiting our wonderful city, and most importantly, for spreading the word of peace and harmony and togetherness. Thank you, Dr. Kadri, and welcome to Brisbane. <laughs> 